everyone. My name is Michaela Coffey. I'm a reporter with M Live and the Ann Arbor News. We're here today at day two of the Ann Arbor Art Fair. The Ann Arbor Art Fair is an annual three-day event that's comprised of three separate juried art fairs um, and will be featuring nearly a thousand artists. The weather is looking a lot better than it was yesterday. Severe thunderstorms unfortunately canceled Art Fair for around an hour and a half but rain isn't predicted for today, so we should be all set. Um, today, Art Fair opened up at 10 a.m. and is expecting to close around 9 p.m. And then tomorrow, for its last day, it'll open at 10 a.m. and then it's expecting to close around 8 p.m. So um, there's already a crowd for me. It's a little bit early, but a lot of people are showing up. So let's go check out some artwork. Hi everyone, we're here with artist Steve Cade. Um, Steve, could you kind of walk me through um, some of your artwork and kind of where you draw inspiration for it? Okay, well, as you can see my work is quite colorful and it's a little bit out there. We have robots, uh, living mushrooms, yetis, robots, more robots in outer space. So really my love of art comes from the past. When I was a kid they always talked about the future and what it would look like in the year 2023. And kind of here we are, and it looks a lot like when I was a kid. So I kind of take the idea of some older things, what they thought the future would be, and kind of incorporate that into my colorful art. In fact, I was doing some reading today, and a lot of my art also, my wife says I'm the eternal teenager, I'm always reading comic books and things. And you can see the, the use of lettering, exciting colors and images put together is kind of what you see here. And then as a small child, I just absolutely loved sharks and fish and whatnot. So that's also kind of taken over my art world a little bit. And uh, I like to reproduce all of the beautiful things that are under the ocean. So in a nutshell, I, I paint things that are under the water and above the atmosphere. Kind of everything but where we're at now. Got you. Awesome. And um, Steve, can you kind of walk me through what it's been like for you this year? I know it's not your first art fair, but how has it been going so far? It's been great. You know, I've been doing the art show since I was the uh, the main artist at the 2011 fair, and each year it's really great. This show, I get people from literally all over the world. I've sold people, uh, worked people in Australia, over in Europe, uh, Japan one year. So it's just great to see how the city brings in people from all over the world to come here. And, and see what we have and then take it home with them. So it's really a joy to see the great crowds every year. Usually the, the mixed weather, which is, it makes it a little exciting when you get the rainstorm in there, but it's just a joy. It's my favorite show of the year, actually. Awesome, and I know um, obviously with the severe thunderstorms, you guys had to close down for a little bit, yep. Yep. Um, but is that, how's that working this year? I mean, uh, today, I mean, is it, going it, well still? It's going well, Good. yes. We, we pre-plan for these things, so we all keep our things off the ground and we know it's part of the job, really. You know, when you get out and you live and try to make a living in the streets, you have to abide by the weather. So we prepare for it and everyone on the street, uh, we keep in touch with each other, let it help each other when we need to. So it, it's all, all good here. And if you had to say what keeps you coming back year after year to the Ann Arbor Fair, what would be your main reason? It's really the people. Far beyond, you know, selling my things and trying to make a living from it, it's just seeing the people and seeing the joy that art is still out there in this day and age with all the technology. People want things that they can hold in their hands and put on their wall and inspire them uh, to be, uh, just to make their world a little brighter. Okay. Thank you, Steve. I appreciate you taking some time to talk with us. Let's go check out some more artwork. Bye. 
Just some of the Ann Arbor Art Fair for day two. Um, just a reminder tomorrow's gonna be the last day, it's gonna end at 8 p.m. So come and check it out if you guys are interested.